Hi everyone, my name is Victor from Victor's Food. Victor's Food does hands-on cooking events and interactive catering events nationwide in Australia. When I do a lot of my events, a lot of people ask me, how do you chop an onion? How do you stop crying from an onion? Some of them say, put a toothpick in your mouth. Some of them say, put bread in your mouth. Some of them say, wash it underwater. I say, pick up the goggles and whack them on and let's go for it. But you have to be safe to do this and you have to be able to use your knife and your knife has to be sharp. So the way you do this basically is take your knife, put your thumb and your forefinger at the back of the blade and then wrap your rest of your fingers around the handle. Take one of your whole onions and then slice it straight down the middle keeping the back part intact which is the root. After that you basically Chop off the very front part and then peel back the onion. In peeling the onion, just make sure that if you keep your mouth open a little bit, sometimes that helps with not crying also, from what I've discovered. And a couple times, if you want to, you can even think about putting them in the freezer for about 15 minutes. That also helps from not crying. But I still like the goggles. I think that works every time. With the onion in place and it's nice and flat, Make sure that you have the back of the root to the left of your hand and then bring your elbow out just a little bit holding on to the sides of the onion with the tip going straight into the onion three quarters of the way through. Now this is probably not a good time to look up and have a chat with your friends. It's really important to stay focused on what you're doing and it's still attached. But then a lot of people say how do you dice the onion because you need to like be able to get it smaller. So again with holding on very securely, then you saw into the onion, three quarters of the way through, three quarters of the way through, and all the way up. Take your knife, tip down, and with a motion going forward, you dice down into your onion, coming up with a lovely dice till you get to the very back. Once you get to the back, stabilize it, and then chop it straight down. At the end, you wind up with just a little bit of the root of the onion. You now have chopped onions and you're not crying. The great thing about this is you can either do them without or with your swimming goggles, but I prefer the goggles.